Tonight, the search is on to find the driver who hit a nurse in Garner as she was walking home from work. Garner police are asking any witnesses to speak up now. In an interview you will only see on WRAL, Willie Danley spoke to the victim who is still recovering at the hospital. The vehicle is gone. The person that hit me is gone. <laughs> Oh, we are living in the wicked world. On August 17th, Victoria Adenaji was walking home from work on Benson Road in Garner late at night. She had her flashlight on so drivers could see her. Before she knew it, she was thrown to the side of the road after a driver hit her and fled the scene. I feel like they treat me like animal. Even animal gets some compassion and empathy. But this person makes me feel like I'm not a human being at all. <laughs> This person makes me feel like I don't belong here. Identity suffered numerous injuries, including a broken hip, leg, and toes. She's had four surgeries so far and expects to have more. She dreams of the day that she's able to return to work. I just want to get back on my feet. Take care of my patient. I'm also a nurse. Get back on my feet and take care of my patient. Identity wants the person who hit her off the streets. Lieutenant Michael Med of Garner Police tells me the only lead that they have is a side mirror that fell off the car that hit her during the accident. He's asking anyone who saw something to say something. If we have a lack of um, cameras or uh, if the victim, you know, didn't see what happened, um, it's uh, vital to have people who may have witnessed the crime occur come forward and be able to tell us um, what they saw, so that way, you know, <clears throat> the evidence is a lot stronger against the suspect. In Raleigh, Willie Danley, WRL News.